of where the shades went. I would like to create a feedback loop. Here we go. Now we're talking. Yeah. <laughs> All right. It sounds pretty good. Ooh. I'm waiting for Windows to update. What are you doing? I think it's done updating. Welcome to Windows. We exited host mode. What does that even mean? Guess we could chat up. <laughs> I definitely do need a minute. Everything looks good. <laughs> Any music? That is not very graceful. Do it again. That's slightly better. Uh, let me know. One view. <laughs> we have seven subs. Like a okay sandwich shop. Trying to find out just the right amount of feedback. And the sunglasses. It's really ridiculous. All right. Let's assume that's working. Hello, viewer. Who's auto hosting me? What's going on? People. Ooh. I've scared them off, I think. Hmm, that looks pretty good. Still shades, I have a problem with shades, as in I don't have enough shades and that's a problem. As you can tell, it's bright over there. They're not going to start typing until you say something. Though. Let's see. You gotta like give them the business and stuff. Microsoft Edge. Not really. Don't don't do it. Goodness. This will not do. I should just switch it to battle right. Oh I really shouldn't be sitting in an office chair. Not right now, it doesn't feel right. As in my back is not digging it. That's because I sit in an office chair so much. It's like, you have to. Do you though? Let me get some form of discussion up. I had Ripcord installed on this computer. No, 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 no. 
TV show, yes. I don't, you know that show about the skydivers? Hmm. Okay. How do you? Interesting. Uh huh. Uh huh. It's interesting. Steam streaming. Okay. We've exited host mode ages ago. Uh, chats. I'm chasing you down. Oh wait, there's Ripcord. Mega Man 11. That's the news. That's new in the news today. It was that time. Mega Man 11 was around. Actually, Hoffy just had like a big music music release. I was to listen to. This is on my other computer. All right. Hmm. Hey everyone. Oh jeez. I wonder if Me6 is cool. I wonder if anyone's around. Hey, it's Link Waker 10. Hello. I'm uh Ah uh, I gotta hide this. How do I other oh, just leave it there? Hello! What should we do today? I guess I can continue where I left off. It's kind of it's kind of busy work. I can as I as I introduce myself every week, hello, welcome. Welcome to a power block type event. I'm gonna do some modeling. And you know, I guess hang out for a couple hours. Somebody was is it plug zone? I'm hanging out on Discord. I'm trying to find I'm trying to find a couple of y'all's y'all's musics. Where? But where? Is it this? It is it is Hoffy, isn't it? Javi is like a retro mix preview. Ooh. This could be louder. Might as well find anything. I don't know. Just trying to be trying to be safe. What so what I do in order to like keep my spine from hurting is like create a compound in injury by like leaning against it like ah oh, this is the part that doesn't hurt yet so you know am i allowed to like this track it's top secret also let me know if the music is uh reasonable i don't know if in a recent scene wow i need to up my game Yeah. Let's see. So we were upgrading these parts. Do do do. I didn't really get that far, did I? I got this guy done. We decided on creases. And bug like shapes. I think I got this far. I think I can agree with that. I 
I like hoppy music a lot. What's this? I currently don't hear any music. Maybe the audio can be... Oh, I know what it is. All right. I'm glad we tested this. Sometimes it just needs to be plugged in. Uh, let's see. The best way to test this is by creating a feedback loop. Go! That should work. According to my, uh, yeah, yeah. Let me know, Linkvaker Ten. Linkvaker Ten, please tell me. Let me double check our mix it and oh my goodness. Although I'd be able to tell if I went in here. Oh. Huh. Oh wait. What does this button do? Oh my gosh, there are ten Oh look, there's a mute button. That should be way better. Just give it five seconds. Or, I mean, by the time you hear it, it'll be... It'll be like zero seconds. Uh, doesn't bother you, then we're cool. That's weird. All right, well then we'll do the power drill. <laughs> I didn't even realize my mic was on. I was still under the impression that it wasn't. Uh, what am I trying to do here? 
So tell me, Link Waker, tell me about your day. Did you watch Mega Man announcements? Why would you? It's in the middle of the day. I'm excited to play Mega Man X for the 700th time. Honestly. Bobby and I were talking about it right before it happened, as it was happening. It's a good day to be kind of right. Do you like coffee music? Oh man, that's what I want to do. Ah, why am I do? Why am I not doing that right now? I guess I just should get some time in on this project, right? One thing at a time, right? <laughs> coffee music? I mean, coffee would be great. I think I have to get coffee tonight as well. I don't know how much I want to be up. I'm just kicking my own butt these days, man. It is like the constant quest to get ahead. Like, I think at some point you just have to determine that you, you just have to tell everyone that you won. And like, the fact of the matter doesn't, you know, it's not the point, right? Homeboy's got some family tracker techniques, so. though. Why is it this face? Why? Oh, you know, I thought this would take a lot longer to get through. Super Retro Maker's not that bad. For some reason, maybe I've seen a different link or something like that. Like, I, I was expecting it to take a lot more out of me. Because I look at, I look at a, I look at the tabs that I have open and the things I've yet to listen to. I mean, I'm not trying to experience every single thing, but, you know, there are certain characters that, that I definitely want to examine as much of their work as possible. And Hoppy is gaining that respect. What? I have a message. Yeah, but music is such a good thing, right? And it takes, sometimes it takes a few listens. I'm, you know. Sometimes for me, I'm gonna tell you, it takes a few listens. What are you doing? I 
that would look better. Oh no, that looks okay. I just like that there's so much stuff that... There's so much good stuff to process that other people can process a lot of good stuff and usually tell me what the good stuff is. Right? Like, not that they're doing all the work for me, but that... that... there will... there will be more good stuff. Right? We all, we all bring out the good stuff together. I assume this mic is working because it's really close to my face, but... Is this the same set? I don't think so. Hoffy. Follow Hoffy on SoundCloud. Hoffy's in our Discord. You know that link, Waker. Look, here's Hoffy. Uh, Hoffy is way cool. had to say that on stream and also set stream let's listen to the coffee zone why not <laughs> excellent maybe I should follow the coffee zone why can't I hear the coffee zone why is it muted what good is that to I'm not a 3D modeler, I'm a 3D noodler. Oh, this is nice. What do we got here? Chatting me up in chat. Mouse slip, my favorite trip tune album. Chip tune album there. Alright. I gotta know more. I wanna know more about chip tunes. I'm starting to study um like the modarchives.org so like some some demo scene type of music um, in an effort to better understand Jake's Jake's technique studying studying his style he's very much a a demo scener in the sense of the word, even going to the point as to say, like, we're demonstrating what a synthesizer can do, like, a MIDI synth in particular, right? a god though well, I mean I don't know what differentiates him from many artists especially those in our community it's really the experience it's the it is it is I would say he's certainly he's certainly a master of of the of the chip tune But also maybe I'm not as much like enough of a chip tune aficionado. Like maybe I'm the wrong person to ask, you know. Looks stupid. Looks less stupid. 
That looks the least stupid. Yeah, I like the flat edge. Let me just bring that down a little bit. It's kind of like a crab or something. If you're looking at purest stuff, Fear of Dark and Jake are the best. Okay, okay. What kind of genres do I usually listen to? I guess I'm a, I guess I'm a hip hop head. Um, let's see. I really like jazz a lot. I'm a big fan of that. Um, funk is making a pretty large comeback. I like soul music, you know, in general. I guess anything, anything that has some, some pretty serious, you know, um, I guess hum humanity in some ways. Um, not to disregard chipsy music as like some some kind of soulless craft. It's absolutely not. But I guess the point that I'm making is. I kind of, I didn't come up through computer music as much as music, uh, just like, just, just soul singerly. <laughs> um, that's like my experience, soul, soul hip hop, R&B. Um, Maybe, maybe a little gospel. I grew up um, going to like a Baptist church and doing that whole singing in the choir thing when I was younger. With my aunt playing piano. Um, and I learned how to learn songs, I guess, kind of in that environment, because you learn a couple, like you learn a whole set of songs every week and there are hundreds of church songs. I stopped going to church when I was in high school. Um, <laughs> yeah, and or no, when I was like 13 or 14. And I got into jazz bands. Uh, I played trombone for five years and picked up guitar when I was a edgelord in high school. And I've been just kind of doing that. I wanted to I wanted to get into the rock, you know. I wanted to to be a rocker. Uh, it worked out. <laughs> this kind of looks like a weird body part. I want to accentuate. Um, but yeah, no. I mean, what I've learned about Jake over the last couple of years that I've known him is like the dedication to this craft and understanding like the technology as part of the music. Right? Like, oh, that's just, look at, look at what this chip can do. I'm like, I'm a big fan of that in game development, like in general. And so to see that come out in a musical expression is like a really sweet combination, actually. So I've learned, I've gained a lot of respect for that over the last, like, over the last couple of years. Um, I've done like fake bit stuff. Um, But those who are trackers, those who are chip tuners and family trackers, which I'm, you know, hopefully you guys will welcome me t to, to the party. <laughs> um, like, I think, I think there's a lot of cool stuff to do there. Hate's a strong word. Huh? I don't know. Yeah, it's really, it's really hard to like, <laughs> yeah, it, it's okay. Hate, hate is a strong word. I mean, I guess we prefer not to use the word hate so that we don't diminish the term. But hate's not like a great word to keep strong anyway, so I understand where you're coming from. But I'm, you know, everybody who, everyone I've met in the, in the, in the, Video game, VGM, game composer sphere. It's just been in being introduced to more and more crazy cool music. Like if you are on the Discord, you're doing this Tales of S or not Tales of Gosh, uh, Estrian Odyssey, <laughs> Tales of Estria, which might as well exist because it seems like the same thing. I see that's the other thing is I'm like a huge video game nerd anyway. I went to school for this kind of video game stuff. I know a crap load about game technology. Um, but just, for some reason, not sound. Uh, you know, that came way later. 
Um, I actually had to like get into programming and come back around to programming audio before I was like, oh yeah, that's really, this is really special. Wow. Uh, what the? Yeah. And I absolutely understand why. I mean, not completely like your preferences and stuff, but there's a lot of like hip hop and stuff that doesn't appeal to me at all. There's tons of music out there. And it's a very, very, uh, very vast and deep universe of this like nonverbal language. So. Get to studying. I want to grow selection here. I'm trying to get control over a very specific set of faces. It again. Is it you? I think it is you. Operations, yeah. Tales of Adrian and <laughs> featuring Dante. I'm telling you, I'd play it. There's supposed to be a Tales game on the Switch, and I will buy it. I'm a sucker for that series. Even though the music is not the best, like that Odyssey soundtrack is so good. Like, you, it's, it's, let's just say I'm learning a lot. I'm studying, I'm studying mod, the mod scene. Um, I'm learning from everyone in Discord, so thank you so much for continuing to post stuff. Team Ad today posted this, like, band, Nowhere, or something like that. What? I have not played Xenoblade, actually. I'm kind of avoiding it, because I have Bravely Default and Bravely Second on my 3DS, and I'm gonna, like, I beat Tales of the Abyss last year, and it just, JRPGs just take time, right? So, not being a person with that kind of time, I'm, like, very picky about <laughs> about which, which JRPG I'm gonna subject myself to and for how long. Um, that looks pretty good. Doesn't have enough seams, in my opinion, but, you know, We'll actually kind of need like a boar or something to go through here. Or do we? We can probably like shrilk that right there. <laughs> Get it? This is Xenoblade reference. Oh, okay, okay. A star ocean were more recognizable. Okay, okay, okay. Yeah, I mean, I've heard really good things about about bravely the bravely dudes i played the uh i played the octopath traveler demo i thought that was pretty good it seems a little bit it seems a little bit underdeveloped but i hear that the systems are kind of the same like i don't know if i like a lot of voice acting i don't know if i like a lot of absurd stuff uh i, I can't really tell you what it is about any of these games that i like but I'm willing to try Xenoblade, it's just I'm the type of dude that'll want to play, like, every Xenoblade game. And just, you know... I don't know if that's productive. But that's, that's like... That's like what I want. You know? I want the whole experience. I want to be able to, to, to say something about the series, like, kind of in its, you know, as a whole. I want to care about the characters, you know, I want to get into it. JRPGs are like books, and I really like that feeling. Okay. 
give Xenoblade OST a listen. I shall, I shall, I shall. I'm still blown away by the uh, Eternal Odyssey OST. Like, I haven't even played Nier Automata. Like, I'm telling you, I'm, I'm behind on everything. Don't tell Jake that I haven't played it yet, because he'll punch me in the face. Which is fine, but I mean, like, you know, I don't want you to see him punch me. Because I have Stockholm Syndrome. Bevel. Whoa. That's not what I want. Maybe it has to be even. Yeah, right. Fine. Is that just facing the wrong way? I'm a little worried about you, guy. Maybe I can't have what I want. Explain yourself. This is crazy good music. <laughs> Biggest flaw is that it wants you to play through the game multiple times to get the true ending. Yeah, okay, okay. I mean, I think, yeah, there's a lot of games that have that problem. But. It kind of has that, like, Ikaruga aesthetic. I was a huge fan of that game. Uh, I didn't know it would become a collector's item. I could have bought a bunch of them, because, like, they came out really, really cheap uh, for the GameCube. Let's see. No, really, I was, I was definitely, definitely blown away by that soundtrack. Like, and I think it's just the context of the challenge as well, or something like that. Where it's like, oh, wait, we have to do what? This is amazing. Um, and I don't know, uh, Link Waker, do you know if there are any other parameters for that challenge? Like, I noticed there's a bunch of tracks open, and I might just, like, pad my ego and do a bunch of those things. Uh, obviously, in the next day. Hopefully for a little help tomorrow. You know, if you're interested in that. I think that'd be fun. What is going on here? Oh, that's kind of neat. It looks like a fingernail. It looks like a fingernail. A fingernail. This is the It's kind of weird. Okay. It's like a crease. I just, I wanted to have something, like, on this structure that was a little bit more defined. Maybe I could split the edge? It's the same thing as beveling, right? Sort of? Kind of? Like, the edge loop and split is the idea. What the f- I think I did it. Do it again. Sweet. If it doesn't look like a weird body part, you're doing it wrong. Look like a giant butt to me. It shows the rules. I'm looking at the. Well, I know there are a lot of docks that are. Like, Cause look, there are so many that are empty. There's get the treasure. That's empty. This is empty. This is like there's nobody wants to do these three tracks. You could do these two tracks, like festival of worship. I don't even know what that is. People are taking all the cool tracks. There's still like what two, three, four. Six tracks open? Seven? I mean, we got options, people. This is the future. Ooh, that is a, that is a good look. It's weird, like, I, you know what? I know what the problem is. I want that.
but like I don't want that for most of you. Like how do I just finally? Uh, uh, uh. Digging this 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 music. Cause there's their own there's their own it's like guitar solos, like there's their own language of there's a language of of effects. You know. Like doing a manual echo. Up switch. It does. I think somebody had like a now playing thing talking through what's going on. Yeah, so I want to know. Isn't there like a now playing or something like that? I think it only works with YouTube. But yeah, it's important for me to listen to as much new stuff as possible. I'm, I'm learning, I'm learning that there's so much, there's so much in like the styles of music that I'm used to producing that is missing ideas from chip tunes or from demo tracks. Like it's actually pretty, it's pretty amazing how how much both, you know, how much all genres benefit from collaboration. That's basically what I'm saying. Maybe everything is fusion. I don't know. I just work here. And I also do a bunch of other cool stuff. But it's a good time to be a creative. It's a bad time to be an MC if you're not rhyming correctly. Um. Is that too much? Is that too ridiculous? Like, that's pretty weird, and you can't really see it. Except for when you can. What if I did this? I oh, see, now you do what I want you to do. talking about exactly what I'm thinking about is that you know you, you, despite being able to describe music 
as the as the actual best. Like that's kind of not the point. Like I can recognize the technical achievement, right? I want to be able I want to be able to see it in that way. Cuz even with like really stupid like high end you know, expensive sounding beats, right? That's like I don't know, it doesn't have the same actual limitation that that a chip tune do. I'm just manipulating the crap out of this mesh. It looks like some weird spiny vibrator thing. I don't think that's I don't think that's actually spooky or futuristic. Like Let's walk it back. Let's walk it back. Let's get, yeah, let's get rid of the, these ridges and like, what's the point of all this? Extra geometry. I'm out of undo history shit. Okay. Well, it's fine. It's fine. We can we can do something with this. It's a pretty great track. Though. Us, the internet also makes me feel like I'm not actually absorbing anything. Um, which is totally not true. Modifying my filter. But it feels like a lot. Like the more I get into it, the deeper, the deeper it goes, right? It's good. It's a good feeling. Oh, that's way creepier. Yeah, that looks way more like a butt. Oh yeah. Oh, that's way creepier. Now we're talking. Hello, Flippy Monkey. Yeah. Interesting. Every ship has its own personality that imparts into the music. There are lots of chips, too. I think I was introduced to that on... You know, on, on Jake's terms, on the high end, right? Where he's talking about, oh, dude, the sound, the sound blaster, right? Um, this Yamaha synthesizer that still uses it. Do, 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 do. What's going on, Flippy Monkey? Back, back, back. I don't know if that's right. I can't see. That's a cool noise. It's very squeaky. Trash can? Really? Well, it doesn't look like you're actually uh, in front of it. Ah. Yeah, there's like a shallow indentation here, but like it looks like you're this far in. He wasn't talking to me. Hi. 
so many chips. Chips are delicious. What is Jake's favorite chip? I think it's Cool Ranch. Um. <laughs> I don't know. He 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 he's talked about uh, a. <laughs> he's talked about he's talked about like a fantasy console that is a hybrid. Uh, it's a SNES Genesis hybrid. So it would have the eight PCM channels, and then you would have the Genesis <laughs> sounds, which I guess is like, what is it, like four FM, or three FM and one noise and one PCM? Right? Right, the dream, the dream 16-bit console, exactly. And I think you can set it up, like you can make something that sounds like it using Impact Soundworks' tool. Um, because they have, right, like, Super Audio Cart has that kind of emulation. So, I mean, it's not emulation, it's sample base. But you can kind of make an amalgam of it. I bet you could do something like that with I mean, one of these trackers. I mean, somebody, you know, that's the dream 16-bit console. There's, tell me there isn't one nerd out there who's been like, all right, we're doing it. And then they, and then they do it, and it exists, and everyone can, like, make their super cool 16-bit sounds. Right? Sounds great though. Is this all like this whole is this whole set 2A03? <laughs> 6 FM3 PSG. come to really enjoy like the Neo Geo FM sounds, right? It's very sharp. Um, there's, a, there's a mix that I should actually download and play. I don't know if you like watch my uh, my my bookmarks whenever like I'm logged in. So there's this DJ. Oh, I'm totally... Keep me logged in. So there's this website, themixingbowl.org and there's this DJ that I've been into for forever. Um, Evil Dave and Evil Dave mixes are kind of rare I have a lot of his older stuff he used to have a blog uh, like a blog spot site and he would just do super cool you know just super good digging super good DJing stuff which I think I might re download all of these things but there is a, there are two video game remix, or video game mixes, which are really good. So I'm going to actually, I'm actually going to find one of them, because I think you'll recognize a lot of these sounds. Uh, high scores chip tunes, there we go. Give me that. It's a torrent file. You know what that means. We're gonna we're gonna use the torrent. I hope there's nothing crazy in U torrent right now. I don't imagine so. Okay, yeah. Uh, the Eric Andre show. Okay. Uh, yeah. This is not how you pirate stuff. So. Look, let's watch advertisements. So stupid. But yeah, check out um, check out Evil Dave whenever you get the chance. He's a great, uh, great. I don't know if he's a, a DJ in in uh, the, away from the keyboard, but you know, 
We, it's gotta be. Two less FM channels, way beefed up PCM. That makes sense. Oh, okay, okay. It's pretty crazy stuff. Oh, I see, they put the chips here. So what is the MMC5? Like, what are these other modules that are for the NES? Because I assume this is all family tracker stuff, looking at what's on here. Oh, that was quick. Sweet, I guess we have Evil Dave's remix. I'll get that in there after this album, because I have that kind of time. Penguins of the Apocalypse. But VRC6, like, that's the same... You know, that's like the family tracker trip sound set, right? At least upgrade from Moo Torrent. <laughs> I don't even know what was on this computer. I can totally blame whoever installed Moo Torrent. Um, should I get like, I don't know. Recommend, recommend me a, 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 a thing. I can't even remember what they're called. I haven't torrented anything in a while. So, you know. <laughs> Just so you know, I haven't torrented anything in a minute. So, tell me about the hot, the hot, the hot tools. I used, uh, I used Deluge on the Mac. That is pretty good. Um, I guess there's a Windows version of it. I don't know. What's it? I don't know. Set that back. Creepier. It's much creepier. What's the tracker? Ah, yeah. Well, then I'll get Deluge on Windows. I'm into that. I mean, it's too late now. I already downloaded the thing that I want. But we'll get Deluge. Uh, Torrent. Just give me the thing, man. Available for Windows. Awesome. I would like the Windows version. Whatever. They have... Uh, Five, one, five. Okay. So sign up for the mixing bowl. Actually, there's probably a bunch of crazy like chip tunes. Like, I'm pretty sure this is like a DJ. Like. Shift tune, shift step, dental, dental dubs. I don't know if. Uh, see, this will show you yeah, all of the tracks. But Neo Geo. And people are just a fan of this Evil Dave cat. So we're gonna listen to some of that stuff because it's awesome. All-time favorite games. But this guy's got like, this guy's got pretty serious, like, pretty serious art of the DJ. Like, I mean, aside from like music production in and of itself. Streamlabs? Streamlabs. Streamlabs? Streamlabs? 
Isn't Streamlabs the like the the integrated like tip system and they like have your metrics and stuff, right? Um, yeah. Number one. Let's log in with Twitch. Okay. And so Streamlabs, isn't this, is this what you mean? It shows us stuff that's happening. And it used to do overlays on the other setup that we had, but I haven't actually. What? Oh, weird. I think it's asking you to do a thing. Oh, yeah. Okay, 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 okay. So, I added a Streamlabs plugin. That's right. I added a Streamlabs plugin to the front end of the Twitch stream. So, like, normally you would do a thing that's, yeah, yeah, we're like what we're talk like talking about. So, Twitch has, like a, like, a plugin system now. And you can install these applications onto your channel that people can see, like, client side. Which is pretty neat. Um, let's see. But it allows you to do things like, I guess from the dashboard we can, we can set up like giveaways or something, I don't know. It looks like they're trying to compete with like HQ, with their own interactive web-based thing. Uh, trying to get Twitch videos to grow up, and I respect that. Because it really should be a lot smarter than, like, the basic, oh, yeah, well, you know, you should, you should watch the video. And, uh, Twitch knows what's up. They're gonna, what the? Did I really do that? No one's gonna notice that. This is a robot. It needs some weird awkwardness. Harder. Look at me go. Oh, stop, stop. Go, go. Give it robot bubbles. The robot bubbles thing? Let's have a look. Let's go let's go look at our Twitch. Our Twitch thing. I'll show you what I'm talking about. Look, it's me. Oh crap. Hey, thanks everyone for watching. Um, so if you go to your dashboard, there's a new thing called extensions on Twitch. And I signed up for their developer program, but they haven't gotten back to me. So this is what's asking you to, for permission. It's the Streamlabs loyalty music polls and games thing. Uh, which you guys might know more about than myself. I'll get rid of these other guys, because whatever. But like smart click maps. Like this is cool, because like you can get something that like lets people, lets, lets me see where you're like tapping or clicking on the screen, and then we can render it over the stream or whatever, right? Wait, what? Give the stream boobs. What? 
Give it the robot, the robot boobs. I don't know. So anyway, you had these like extensions, right? Somebody's just like, oh, Pub PUBG live tracker, yes. But live emote reactions. I don't know what the heck any of this crap is. Shows the top countries your viewers are coming from. Finland, Finland and Finland. Um. Chat overlay like Nico Nico. Sure. But see, that's just kind of a weird thing. Because we have chat overlaid on our stream, so I don't know what it actually looked like. Oh wait, I'm actually looking at the stream. I can. Will, will it work while I'm running, do you think? I don't know, let's try it. What? Okay. This extension has no configuration. Perfect. Let's activate it. Replace it. Okay. So then look, I go to the channel and like have a look at like what's going on here. Cause what I'm expecting, right, is so there's this TV guy that shows up, right? And it shows the chat. Oh, just scrolling across the top. So if I say something smart, then it comes up here. Smart face. So that's not actually part of the video, right? Um, and there are a bunch of other extensions of the sort. But I don't get to see those things. Like, that's a client side thing. So let's go find robot boobs, I guess. Boobs. Because it's, it's a cool idea. You could do a lot of cool stuff. Um, schedule in their time. One thing that I don't like about this, and I think this has a lot to do with um, just the, like, I can't activate multiple things at once. Set as extension overlay one. Like, I think you have to be a, like, polls, giveaway, song request, whatever points are, right? So we can do this thing where you, like, you know, hit a button and it pulls up points or whatever. Um, Streamlabs looked like it had the most kind of features that I was interested in, but there's a bunch of other neat stuff. Um, I signed up for uh, to be a developer, like to get to get access to all of this stuff, and they haven't listened. <laughs> I don't know. Like, I, I guess they're getting a lot of requests or something. But I like I have access to like the dev landing page, but I can't test out applications. But like, it's actually a pretty good sense of what the heck it is that people are actually doing on the site. And it's interesting that games that are as new as Paladins are so well, so already have like a plugin, like it's part of, you know. A shot box. Weird. Wow, this is growing very rapidly though. I feel like this is the end of the game. There will always be next year. It's not even the end of the game. There's so much more. It's a cool song. It's King of the Fo the King of the Fog or whatever. That's good. Invite viewers to game with you. Completely hassle free. Hmm. How does that work? Interesting. I don't know, Dougie, what do you think of this weird technology? After the Salvin ends, play this. Okay. Okay, we're gonna install tomatoes. So you can throw nutritious whole ripe tomatoes. Configure. Demo has a one second cooldown. So, I don't know exactly what this is aiming for. This is what it, this is what it'll be like. You have a tomato timer. This is, a, is this HTML5? The 
mater grow. Look, it points at the mater. And then I guess there's some other script that's actually doing that. All right. Cool. So you can get the position of the mouse and toss the mater. All right, we're totally installing the tomato throw. You can throw tomatoes at me right now if I activate this overlay. And let me know if this works on your phone. Because obviously if I go to our channel here, if I press online, oh, channel, over there. So this reloads, right? And then it reloads the video with this tomato application on top of it. And now I can throw tomatoes at myself or at this Nuren generic lady. This is this is the smartest thing that I think that I think that that has ever happened. But I don't know if other people can see that, right? Like it's 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 satisfying for me, the tomato thrower. I don't know how you feel about it. Let me know. I'll be over here. It should work on your phone though, like why not? It's okay, it's okay. Just, uh, you know, reload your, your player and try and hit me with a tomato. Hold on a sec. Gosh. I like this album though. I'll add it. Uh, to, I have a playlist actually. What is this? Add to next stuff. What the? Dude, don't mess with my method. Whatever. I will heart it. The Coffee Zone is a good album. Oh, that's a cool noise. I'm trying to like, so I have a playlist that is non-nerdcore hip hop. Anyway, I gotta get back to shaping the polygons of the future. Yo, thank you so much, man. Oh, okay. How did how did it fare? Perfect. Okay. All right. Well, well, all right. When are you coming back? Uh, yes, I reckon so. Cool. Well, have a good day, man. Thanks. That was our wonderful electrician, Andy. If you can hear him, ladies and gentlemen. He's made a lot of this building work, whether you like it or not. Like, replacing breaker boxes completely. Because the one that we had was not big enough for the amount of power that we need to draw. The song is perfect for that exposition. Uh, that's probably the power is not amount that's not the issue. But you know, good electricians are good. They keep you safe. They keep your electronics on and stuff. I don't like where this is going. It's a cool dance track. Huge. Huge. Ah, that's not many of This must have died. You've got some, you've got some character, you got some spine. Ooh, what? Okay, this is cheating. VRC7. Okay, so what's in a VRC7, those who are paying attention? Tommy Knot and DevDog Double X, hello. We're going to figure out this and more. VRC7, I guess, is like... Is he just going crazy with the... Sample? I don't know what the... Like, that's a very good sounding... Rhodes, Rhodes like noise. Right? It's 
very relaxing. Like I like I like that kind of noise. My friend. My streaming friend. Hello, welcome to uh, welcome to the chat. Welcome to the show. Um, today we're going to be making deviled eggs. In 3D model form. I want everything to either look like a jet or a butt. Thank you so much. I don't know if you, you know. <laughs> we're doing what we can. I'm having fun on this stream. We're making pretty curvy things. I'm just trying to mind density of detail. Because I went from this model, for those of you who haven't seen this, I went from this model over here, which is super low detail, to something with much more detail. Um, like, that's basically it. We're just, we're just subdividing and adding, adding some edges and stuff. Cause I like the weird bug-like nature. <laughs> the bug-like nature of this piece. It's very much like an insect. So we listen to music that is usually uh, decided on by the listeners, and then I talk to myself for about two and a half hours, and then Sophie comes by, and we all play video games and laugh. It's pretty good, I guess. These are the eye knobs, nibs of a bug, right? So wouldn't I want to like give this some some sections, right? It's the kind of music that makes me feel like everything's so simple. Nothing to worry about. There we go. That's how we were doing this in the past. And I can get an edge ring on both sides. Bloop, bloop, bloop. To faces, to faces, to faces. I'm going to extrude those faces. Where the crap is my transform face? It's in there. It's in the butt dimension. At this point, I don't know what to say. Like, I feel like there will always be more. There will always be more chip tunes. So we got that first edge in. That's sweet. Maybe we should make it conform more. Oh gosh. There we go. It's just this big metal object in the way. I don't know. This is the last track. Hey, it's Mr. Madbrain. Fear of Dark. The coffee zone. Wait a minute. Wait, what? 
Oh, this is somebody else. Hey, man. Jester. You're alright, man. But Hello Coffee commented on this. I know that guy. Wow, there's a whole there's a whole world of these progressive chip dudes out there. Let's add this guy to a playlist. <laughs> uh yes. Alright. Um now where was I? Tell me more. Now playing Palmarama live on a 32X. Cool visualizer. Shows what each voice is doing, kind of. Is it just note on events? Word. But I also want to be able to hear. It doesn't use the 32X though. <laughs> Isn't the 32X just for color? Like, it doesn't actually do anything really for audio? I could be wrong. I'm just saying. Jaster is way worth a follow. I, you know what? Link Waker, I have a hard time. I have a hard time with SoundCloud follows, man. I appreciate it. <laughs> I appreciate it. And I just, I don't, my feed doesn't give me anything good anymore. Like, because when SoundCloud introduced, like, reposting a track, it just threw everything off. Like, I couldn't, I couldn't just, like, hear what people uploaded <laughs> anymore. It was like, what, what I, what people, people that I like reposted a track that they like, and that's, like, not always a good thing, you know? Um... Like I'm following you on SoundCloud because it's because it's you. I I, if I take that kind of important or kind of seriously, right? I want to be able I want to be able to hear your idea. Um, maybe we can have a conversation that'll lead me to this other artist. Um, Or, you know, SoundCloud will kind of randomly offer it up. Like, I'm for that, right? We need more segments. We can't just be doing this. With five segments, I need just like two. Twelve. How about three? I'm sorry, I changed my mind. Twenty-three. There we go. That doesn't look as good. Well, maybe. I'm willing to experiment. What? Oh. Right, because I, I want I want to hear like I wanna hear I wanna hear this guy. I wanna hear whoever it is. And so usually what happens is most of the music that I listen to that's new is like a direct reference it's a direct like somebody i know via discord in this case right will just be like you need to listen to this guy and i'm like all right and that's what we do letting the machine serve up culture for me is just it doesn't doesn't work um because a robot's not gonna have as good of a guess based on listening to whatever the my response to Etrian Odyssey or something. Right? That's like, oh hold on, you like that. Or I really like this. Like the computer doesn't have a preference, right? The algorithm doesn't go, I really like the Sega Genesis music. Here's more Sega Genesis music. You'd, like that kind of requires people still. And, uh, isn't that nice? Let's convert my selection to faces to faces. Uh, where is this area? Z 
There we are. I have found you. Ah, it's that moment where you're like, it was totally worth it. Except for that moment. That moment was not totally worth it. Hold on, just hold on to that in the back of it. Hold it. And I could deal with a little bit of that, but not a lot of bit of that. There's no way to do that universally correctly. But like, I like it, that look, you know, that look, it makes this piece like seem like I know what I'm doing, right? Single song that's been retweeted by multiple people you follow. Right. This is there, there's got to be there's got to be a better algorithm. There's got to be a more personal method. And like really, the answer to that is you just personally give a crap and you you go you go to Discord and you look at Plug Zone or you look at the tune spaces or you ask your buddy. You say, hey, you know, Team Ad, what is this band you are talking about, my guy, or Dogen? I need to know more about FM synthesis. And then, like, it happens. You gotta be honest about those interests, I guess. What more could he ask for? Because otherwise, I'm just gonna keep getting served TED Talks and oatmeal. That's right, I said it. So, I like this edge. I like this edge. And this edge. Yeah? Can we agree on that? Hey, calm it down. Calm it down. That's kind of neat. It's not like really what I was looking for, but it kind of, it kind of, it's kind of neat. It's kind of like a mantis of sorts. It's weird. Screw it. Let's rock with it. You look like a Mega Man creature. These voices seem disoriented to you. I always wonder, it's like, is your favorite chip just attached to to that game that you spent so much time playing? Right? There's gotta be a correlation. Yeah, that looks good, man. I just, I'm really bad with feeds. I'm like, okay at Discord sometimes. Hey, did you know Epic Tavern is live? We should go watch them. How do you do a raid? I think that that's a feature now. I'm telling you, Twitch keeps adding all this weird stuff. Oh my gosh, I typed in slash raid. Yeah, that's probably true for most people. You gotta remember, or you gotta remind me which of those things that's probably true for. I'm so happy with this. That looks so much better. Oh, my brain. I'm less happy with the top part, but with AO, I think it'll look okay. AO, okay. <laughs> that's not completely off-putting. Just that this line crosses, right? Like, it'd be better design for this to be continuous, but this, this part overlaps that, 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 that seam. We can fix this. What is bad design anyway?
Oh, hey, hey there, Turbo. It's a pretty good sound. It's a pretty good sound. You see what I mean? Maybe. I mean, it looks like we need more faces. Interesting sound. Whoa, 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 whoa. What the? No, man. No. Yes, man. Yes. Okay. Object mode. That's better. Do, 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 do. Play the chip tunes. It's okay, we've got like half an hour and change left. We've got time. It's just so lonely over here. I miss I miss Brian. I miss you know Jake. Jake's on vacation. I miss the guys. Ravi's like being Octodad. With his his deadliest his deadliest catch. Ooh, that's not a bad look. Ooh, vertex face. That's why we can't do anything. That's why we don't get nice things. Maybe I should add another ring around here. There we go. But isn't that what you wanted? I just wanted to make you happy. There we go. That helps clean up these edges a lot. Because if you think about the polygons we're actually looking at, right? That's kind of a weird thing about this modeling sub D style. Sub D style! It's mostly okay. There's certain things about it that I kind of can't stand. Like this type of. Why? 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 Oh. What if my cousins ever watch this show? The Mountain, Texas. That'd be cool. My my aunt, for that matter. could tell that I'm mixed because I have both an aunt and an aunt. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, that's my joke of the day. Let's go back to subdivision station. Yeah. Where it takes that geometry and it just does some sort of cubic thing. I don't know, Token, this music's getting me kind of pumped. I do uh, appreciate the authentic play it on the system model. Theater mode, yeah, there we go. Oh, this method is coming along pretty nicely, I gotta say. Don't hate it. You could probably get this into Quixel. Baby. I think that's, I mean, that's honestly the way to go. We are totally Quixelizing this jump. 
Especially this guy. Look at you. You're all pretty now. It's beautiful. It's like a it's like a cricket pumpkin. Uh, I don't think I could have asked for a, a better cricket pumpkin. It looks like you know what you're doing. You have like a brain. You still got like a squishy butt that doesn't really do anything. It's not you're not interesting. But you're you. Like it's kind of difficult for a cube to to inspire you, you know. It's 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 not. It's not likely. Not likely that a cube. Hello! Welcome to Mint Potion! I am Mighty Face! I am not sad to be a cube. I thought I'd find myself here all these years ago. Tell me more about the 32X Genesis. Bye! I'm asking for a friend. I finally have recreated the Green Hill Zone bells. I will make them into a beautiful sound. Isn't that what they are, though? frame mode it makes me feel like intelligence you can understand what that computer is thinking that is pretty cool Every tower collections. Sign up sign into YouTube. No, I'm not gonna do that. I refuse to sign into YouTube. Thank you though. I see more errors. I am error. I see I see more me. It's kinda neat. Not sure that I agree or understand this pocket thing. Uh, but hey, we could probably do something with that. Be the pocket you wanna see. Yeah. Ooh. Insert an edge loop today. Tell him. It's pretty cool. It's 
So I think what I want to do is not a very strong shape. <laughs> uh, we'll see. Where is the tiger? So hard, my darling. Why? What? No. Yes. Yes. Like this, right? Yes. This doesn't seem as precise. Yeah, see, nothing about that says oh, that's a really strong thing. Maybe. Ah, I'm not satisfied with it. That's what's important, you know. Don't get satisfied. Clear, clearly. Like seek, seek satisfaction, but don't get satisfied. So that's a bit stronger. Yes, this type of thing. It's like kind of telescoping. What's up, chat? Yo. <laughs> okay, okay. Enhanced Genesis games. The Jaguar was an interesting piece of hardware that I actually do have some history with. Played it a bit. I mean, the Saturn allowed you to play hands are dragging in at Blockbuster because you were never going to buy one. I'm telling you, man. Our culture is... Our culture misses the mall. This is like my... This is my... My 1996 hypothesis. Uh, you know, consumer culture misses the mall. We miss the mall... Like, uh... Like a like a weird pen pal. That we use. Whoa, this is a weird design. It's kind of working out though. Like it just I don't know. It looks like that looks more like a plant, right? That symmetry. You know what would fix that up really quick actually. Sound a lot though. This truck's got a lot of good space. Oh, 
all game composers that I've met have extreme nerdiness in common. Like, it's kind of like being excited that your computer can draw stuff. It is exactly that, right? My computer can make noise. Are you kidding me? And then we have a whole generation. Saturn was awesome, okay? Ah, I don't. I never had a Saturn. Tell me about your Saturn days. Did you play Nights into Dreams? Is Gex on the Sega Saturn? saying whatever they did worked okay it worked they did a thing and that thing worked perfect that worked perfectly awesome it's just we're just gonna make edge rings crap <laughs> I can't see I'm blind Ooh, funky. It's the, it's the, you know, it's like, it's like my favorite guitar, right? I'm never going to be able to replace my favorite guitar. It was stolen. I've told this story too many times. But, you know, like you want the, you want the one that brought you to the dance. That got you into it. Oh, God. So few minute potions here. Are you a subscriber? What does that star mean? You're a subscriber. Man, that means you get to do this. Is that how you do it? <laughs> Damn, mint option. Virtual fighter. <laughs> Sophie, are you gonna stream? Let me know. I'll be over here without my phone so you oh wait, haha, <laughs> with my phone. So that you can text me. Did you notice that two hours ago someone rings the doorbell? Did you know you can get 4,167 pieces of garlic bread for $1,000? Like, this just doesn't seem edgy enough to me. And maybe, like, I don't want it to be. The level of detail is kind of the same, but it doesn't have the same features. Right? Like, look at this flowing curvature. You know, those kind of weird hooked edges. And then, like, this potted plant-looking thing going on here. Like, what is that crap? I am not impressed by you. However, it does have a similar relationship as this piece, right? And maybe all I have to do is kind of have like an asymmetric like divot in the side of the thing. Maybe that is the answer. Wow. T-Mad, what a guy, what a guy. How does a mint potion taste? Nothing like a mint, I'd wager. Oh, I'd, I don't know. I'd find, I find that it might, it might actually be e extra minty. And probably, probably tastes like hemp, hemp tea a bit. And all honesty, it's more like a hemp tea. I just, I'm calling it like it is. I think it's, I think it's a peppermint hemp tea. Um, what, what are you? Look at this. Look at that. That's not cool, right? See that? That's not cool. This kind of weird, like, like, what, what is, what is the functional purpose of this, like, can I, can it bend slightly? Like, if I were to put, like, a, what's my animation tool set? Or isn't there a freeform deformation tool in this thing as well? Yeah, I'm totally just... Did I save my work this week? Um, you get that feeling that you just don't ever save? Like, I want to be able to find FFD. 
Use wild card search. Is it an animation tool or what? It is a deformation. I guess lattice. Yeah. Stupid dimensions. So when I see this thing, I'm thinking, I guess maybe like three dimensions. Whoa, just three, not 36, thank you. Um, STU, I'll say. Can I select this box? Uh, and then, do I bend this thing? This is something that I wish Unity had. I think that freeform deformation is pretty dope. Um, you can do a bunch of wicked crap to meshes with FFDs. I don't know if that's the correct answer to my problem. And now I'm just kind of deforming it out of frustration and confusion. But it's a great animation tool, right? Oh, I will eat the rest of myself. Like, that's kind of neat, right? If I was making a PlayStation 1 game, that was a pretty good album. Mouse Lift, you have returned. You returned at the end of the YM 2017 album. I do not believe I've made your acquaintance. I think you'll recognize Slip from Discord. <laughs> but it's still Slip. Atomic something? Yes, Atomic. Good, good guess, self. Didn't have Discord open or anything. Um, I don't know what you guys want to do. So if you what video game are you going to play? I was going to just like put this on. It's very, it's very into video game sounds. It's all... Your battle fire. Your mission starts now. Are you ready? Are you ready? Okay. Why did I create an FFD Three, with no two, child? One, go. go! Tell me about these sounds, yo. You texted me? Get out of here. You did text me. Hold on. One minute ago. Oh, okay. Yeah, why don't you do your damn homework, Sophie? Ahem, <laughs> ahem, Dude, whatever, do your homework. Go listen to some music. You don't have to do a movie night every night this week. How about we do... How about we just do a movie night when people want to watch movies with you? Okay. <laughs> I'm going to read Sophie's text messages. So Duncan, this is a this is an Evil Dave mix of a bunch of video game tunes. Um, boot up noises. Here's a Mega Drive stage select song. This is the this is the song list. Uh, I'll put it Power up. somewhere. You bastard! I mean, I guess it's easier to like take a screenshot. Or like go to this thing uh, on the Discord. Go to the Discord. Yo, Link Waker. Ah, crap! I need to go do the EO cover. That's a good point. I can't be like messing around. Go listen to Evil Dave. Um, I could leave this this on but I suggest if you're into this stuff go to the mixing uh, 2018 can I interest you in the mixing bowl Royal Rumble what even is this 
What do you do? I don't know, it's like a DJ, it's a DJ forum tracker thing. Uh, I'm not gonna do the cover on stream. Thanks for, thanks for egging me on though. I haven't even picked the song. How about you guys pick a number <laughs> and I will do that song. I haven't even listened to the whole soundtrack. I've been, I've been like digesting it bit by bit. I bet if you look at my YouTube history, it's like, oh, you've done, you've listened to half of it. If I do a cover on stream, I think I'll just rush it and it'll come out crap. 13, huh? 13, 13, 13, festival of worship. Okay, that'll be my first pick. Um, what's the, what's the next, what's the next pick? Uh, my second pick is gonna be this one. My, my third pick is gonna be uh, this one. My fourth pick is uh, this one. And my, my last pick is gonna be this other unpicked one. And there's still more tracks left. What the crap? How are we gonna get all these tracks done, you guys? Atomic should choose, definitely. Slip over here, that was the answer. But it's good stuff. I'll leave the music on for Dogen, I think. I need to get up and start thinking about these remixes. Street Fighter 3. Ah. Um, cool. I guess that's pretty good timing. So, I'm gonna let it play out. I'm not gonna kill the stream. You can listen to it. <laughs> here's the playlist. Uh, here's, the, here's my three model progress. As you can see, I kinda screwed up this thing. Oh my gosh, I know this song. That's right. I got messages from DJ Boosh. Um, I'm gonna hide my beautiful face. I should do ecstasy. What? Oh, okay, okay, okay. <laughs> yeah, um, I think so. <sighs> ecstasy, ecstasy, ecstasy. Oh, that's my fourth pick. So, uh, since you're slip, since you're in control here, or the drugs, whatever. Um, like, what is there? Other are there other guidelines? Like, I saw the other list where it's like you know we'll do a stream tomorrow. I think you're hosting. Um, I'm. We'll play the tracks and stuff. <laughs> like, that's. Is, can we just do it like full. Uh, just like whatever gear we have, just do like a full cover of it. No like weird restrictions. That's five Pacific. Please continue. this game. Good stuff. Anyway, my model is kind of ruined. I guess I could get rid of that, that FFD. But I also don't really like how that this part came out anyway, so. Whoa! Oh, I'm an F50! See, I, could, I guess I could just do that. Um, 
I'm just not sure that I like the position. I don't like. I don't like where this guy. I don't like how you grew up, kid. You know. It looks okay, but it's not distinct. It doesn't have the same kind of like. Look at this. Look at this. Look at this silhouette, man. Like seriously. Where's? Uh. Let's change this material. Cause then we can actually look at it with lighting. Sign existing material. Right? Check that out. Uh, you know, maybe the solo it's not that bad. You know? Crap. That's like a good reason to not hate the thing. Ugh, I don't know. Chat, what do you think? Do I keep this weird pot plant, potted plant thing? You decide. This guy is a schmupper. I mean, I really did grive. Oh yeah, that makes sense. Dude, was, Duggan, weren't you the weren't you the bullet hell guy? Like you were you were showing off some pretty cool bullet hell games early on. Conversation has taken has taken control out of my control. Yo, so if this is just 3D modeling, Glacier Nester, welcome to the show. It's actually about to end. If you're waiting for Sophie to stream, too bad, yo. You're gonna have to catch her next time if she has homework to do. I will not stand for people not doing homework, which is hilarious because I... what? Oh golly. So we're listening to uh, Evil Dave. Crazy anime. Oh man, you can't do that while it's rotating. Disappointed. You have ruined all of my fun, computer. <laughs> Gosh. I'm sorry, I ate homework. Fact, the devil invented homework. Dear darn homework. Uh, what we were modeling. I'm upgrading, um, I'm upgrading this guy over here from being a mere guy of of polygons, which we're not use as a projection kid, to a guy of many gons. Um, much more detail and so on and so forth. Which looks okay. Give me that metallic smoothing. Blam. So, some of it I kind of like. I mean, basically what I did is I started from the tip with a subdivided model. And just proxied my way to the finish. Smoothing, smoothing out and accentuating edges that I want or find interesting. And you compare it to this original. It's clearly night and day, really. Uh, we pretty much stopped around here. As our character gained some strange looking eyes and splines and stuff. And, um... We're only at 226,000 polys for this entire scene, so... That's pretty good. We're not even done yet. But yeah, just kind of going down piece by piece, listening to cool video game music, and making this bug-like thing. I don't know, maybe that shape is redeemable. Just what do you think about this shape? Shot. This is the thing that's been bugging the heck out of me. It's this particular, it's like 
It's like, I thought it was a good idea, and now I don't think it's as good of an idea as I thought it was. That's basically where, that's where my, what's, that's how I feel about that. Like, I want to scale this based on the component. We're gonna get to the end of this mix, how about that? <laughs> yeah, so much. But also trying to untangle these polygons has kind of been producing some cool shapes, so. Can I complain? No, no I can't. What the? F oh. This, they're facing the wrong way. All of you, all of you faces are wrong. It's like a skin that I have no control over. Uh, I think so, actually. Tell him. You win. So, I guess the method is organically fix the model. I like that a lot more now, that it's got like something of a structure. I don't know. Talk to me. Just thinking about Neuron, I was like, what the hell's going on with that? Oh, that's kind of cool. Spartan Bart, tell me what's up. I mean, all of what you're saying is true. He's probably some hobo. He's a huge nerd, yes. I'm not Jake Kaufman. Um, I wear sunglasses because, as you can see in my reflection of the sunglasses, there's chat and uh, there's also chat up there. And there are a bunch of lights and stuff in this room. I'm well lit. I'm very, I'm very lit, as the people say. Um, I do a lot of stuff here at the studio. I'm supposed to be coordinating production for Neuron, which is kind of a newish thing. But please, send me a message. I want to talk to you about that game. I don't know what you expect if you played the demo. Because I want to blow your mind. For a while, I was very uh, much the new Ren apologist. Does this thing start over? No. We're just, we're just getting started. Okay. Um, but... I just wanted to be the best thing it can be. I'm here to help. Part of that is doing visual development. But this model will be in that game. Highly likely. What do you got, chat? Did 
Did you use the tomato? I want to know if that tomato works on your phone. Please tomato me. Come back and tomato me often. I mean, like, it's a virtual tomato. Okay, yeah. I agree with mouse slip. I definitely have not slept enough. I've had a mouse worth of sleep. The name of the stream is a lie. What's the name of the stream? Now I'm scared. Tomiki, you are a dangerous person. What? I'm not, I'm not game deving, I'm 3D modeling. It's completely different. Like, this is just making pretty shapes. Which is, you know, it's all good. I wonder what's not really working for me on this thing. I got like this weird little bucket thing that we managed to untuck from this thing. It's a weird story, but um... Maybe if it doesn't stand out, then it won't bug me. Ah, I just hurt. Don't sit for this long, it's not good for you. This is not dog tracks, but it's good. We should do dog tracks. Sophie, you need to get some rest, dude. <laughs> stream's about to, the stream's about over. Thank you, though. Um, we got couple minutes of high scores left. It's actually pretty perfect timing. Shift tunes at MV3. Listen to Evil Dave. We listened to we listened to YM 2017, I think. It was like a Sega Genesis sounding thing. Uh, we listened to Hoffy music. Delta Boosh. DJ Boosh is coming back in the house. Thank you guys so much. Streets of Rage music is all... What is MML? What is that? Quickly. Mr. Mr. Mad Brain. I must know. Mad Brain, I hope you got my response to your email. Mad Brain. What is MML? I need to know. There's no time. There's no time, guys. There's like a minute left. Hey, thank you so much for watching today's show. Hanging out with me today on stream. I learned that the best topography topology is friendship. Many miniature Legos. Exactly. Wait. Game Streets of Rage. Over. Game over. Oh crap. It's starting over. That makes this way less magical. I gotta shut the thing down. Okay, goodbye. Why is there a ladder in here? Oh man, these video game noises are overwhelming. It's gonna start echoing now? I can't handle Mission echoes. Games, no! Okay. Okay. Countdown begins. Countdown. Three, 